Welcome to the London Youth Express. I am Renata Leufen. And today we want to look at the importance of our young generation for the future of humanity. Humanity needs the children, the young people. Our young people will do many, many great things in the future. We are all endowed with healing virtue and the healing powers are especially strong in children because their faith is often very undiluted. I believe that our young people will be essential and decisive in the healing of our planet and of humanity. We need the children. This planet was created for children and was created for children to be happy. We need to let the children be free. We need to let the children be who they really are. We need to let the children develop naturally. We need the children to dream, to create new and big ideas. We need the children to show us new ways of doing things, of thinking about things. We need our young people. We need them. And they need us. It is time that we, the adults and the young people, work together and come together to do the work that needs to be done at this time. And the work that needs to be done is to liberate humanity and to heal humanity. If we look at our lives individually, we could um, perhaps um, compare our lives with a car. Each one of us has a car and the car is of a certain color and condition. What is your life car? Is your life car broken? Does it have all four wheels? Are there scratches on the metal? Are there parts missing? Our children possess powers that are essential for the healing of society and the nations. The innocence of children is priceless and we should never destroy the innocence of children because it is irreplaceable and of such great value. Let us give our children the freedom that they need. Let us trust our children and let us realize and admit humanity cannot make it without the children. Humanity cannot get healed without the children. Humanity cannot advance without the children. The children are essential for the progress and advancement of humanity. Let us love all children. 
Let us love all children.